Well, food, rent, and so much more are all higher than in previous years. This leaves some residents worried about making payments on time and if they'll have enough. Matt Petrillo has been digging into the data. He found just how much Philadelphians are putting towards housing, and it's not leaving very much to go towards other bills. Matt. Yuki, that's right. You know, we found tens of thousands of people living here in the tri state area spend at least half of their income on rent. Many people tell us that makes it more difficult to buy necessities. I expected a rent increase, but uh, double my rent, I, I couldn't do that. Bruce Ticker was almost priced out of his Northeast Philadelphia apartment when his rent suddenly jumped to more than $1,200 a month last year, nearly twice what he was paying. I felt like a bomb blew up in my face. The 72 year old lives on a fixed income and a small pension. I was terrified. I was afraid I'd be uh, sleeping on the streets. He's not alone. CBS Philadelphia obtained new data from the U.S. Census showing on average about a quarter of renters spend half or more of their income for their apartments in Pennsylvania, New Jersey, and Delaware. It's even higher in Philadelphia, where nearly a third spend half or more of their paychecks on rent. Does that surprise you? Not in this city. Of course, there should be more affordable housing. According to the census, more than 88,000 renters in Philly spend at least half of their income on housing. That's more than the seating capacity at both the Lincoln Financial Field and the Wells Fargo Center combined. We brought up the issue with Councilmember Jamie Gaudier, who represents part of West Philly. A critical issue for the city. She passed a law last year that requires new apartments with 10 or more units in her district to include affordable units. Everybody needs access to safe, affordable housing in order to build a get life for themselves. And Philadelphia does have an eviction help that it offers renters who might be facing trouble. We'll have more details about that on our website, cbsphiladelphia.com. Reporting live in Center City, Matt Petrillo, Yuki and Jess, back to you. All right, Matt, thank you.